What is going on guys? My name is John and we are here with another Stardew Valley video. It's been a while since I actually played this game. No, played any games really, but I am excited because we've got blueberries. Now the reason why I'm excited with these is because they sell each one sells for 80 each and you get three of them per per stop. So you, I'll get like a hundred of these. I'll show you. I should probably put some of this away. I went a uh, little shopping. I bought a second bag. I got some items that we can turn into the community center. I've got today's episode planned out. Grab all these. So. What? Okay. I got a few games with the Steam Summer Sale, and I plan on playing some of those. Uh, I gotta finish my my Dark Souls series. Once I finish the storyline, that'll probably be it for the storyline, and then I'll just do PvP once in a while when I feel like it. If I finish, well, yeah, I'll finish Dark Souls, and then. I'll have Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley can go over a long time because it'll mostly just be me working on the, the town of the for my my farm, and then when they do updates and stuff like that, I can play it for the updates, all kinds of things. Play for fun. But I got 157 blueberries, 14 silver, seven gold. That will sell for quite a bit. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and water my plants, and then I will meet you over at Perry's store, so you can see how much they sell for. Alright guys, we are back at Perry's shop. We are going to sell some of our shit. I think once you sell enough things to him, he'll sell it down at the bottom. Yeah, see? You can buy five blueberries for 160 Whoa, that's actually... But, uh, you can see here how much money I'm going to get from all of this. Uh, I do need to keep... No, I don't want to throw that away. <laughs> no. I need to sell all of them except for one. Before we sell that, we're actually going to go to the community center and drop one of those off because I do not want... I, do, I want to keep one of those so I can give it to the community center for the uh, spring... For, not spring, for the summer crop bundle. So we'll go up here real quick, drop that off. I think it's this one over here. Can eat sap? No. Uh, there we go. Jesus Christ. Uh, winter forging bundles. Fall forging bundle. I thought I. Crystal fruit. I could drop that off. I didn't know I had that for that. <laughs> Uh, I could have sworn I had some type of thing where I needed pantry, artisan bundle, fall crops bundle, summer bundle. That's up here then. Whoops. Summer crops bundle. There we go. And we can be back, sell all those delicious blueberries. It's great because, uh, I love that blueberries give you so much money. That'll give me 20, sells for 13,000, so it'll give me 24,000. I can go ahead and uh, buy this backpack, I can start making things for my farm, make, making it look good. Oh, new achievement. Sweet! Oh, that's cool. So I will buy this backpack. Holy shit, 10 grand! Uh, I'm gonna wait on that then. 
I did not know the backpack was that much. I don't necessarily need it right now though. So we will go ahead and go back to the farm. So over here at the farm, I I guess I met some type of requirement and I ended up getting these mushrooms. Which is really cool because they're really hard to get. A lot of them are hard to get. Like that one. So if, I think if you meet a certain requirement within the game, it allows you to... Um, allows the guy to come up to you and ask you if you want a special this like the special event for it. Um, I I also got the silo built, so that's almost full. And then I just got this this um coop. So we will go ahead and go grab some chickens. I think they're 700 each. I can probably go and check. Let's check to see when they are open. So I might want to hurry up and get down there. They're open until 5. We'll have to see how fast I can get down there. I want to go ahead and check uh, how long it... Not how long, but... Jesus Christ. Ah! <laughs> so many things in my way. I just want to go ahead and check to see what I can get um, for my animals. I know you can get, once you get to uh, the big coop house, you can get ducks, which is cool. Uh, I will want some ducks. Get your farm animals from this lady. Purchase animals. I can get chickens right now. Chickens. I think that's a duck, I'm not sure. Choose coop for your new chicken. I'm gonna buy three of them. Leslie. Alright, we're gonna name our new chicken. I'm going to name the first one Tenders. Whoops, not ten tender. Chicken tenders. <laughs> Alright. I'll send tenders to her new home right away. Oh, nice. And buy another one. We'll just do a random name for the for the next one. That's, uh, sure. I'm so glad that these things aren't expensive. Supply shop. Heater keeps your animals warm. Warmer and happier during the winter. Milk pail. Gather milk from your animals. Shears used to collect wool from sheep. Can I go down? No. I can get hay. That's cool. I don't need any of that stuff though. Not now, not right now at least. Purchase this third chicken. Wolo, I like that name. <laughs> All right. Now that we got our, our chickens, let's go ahead and try to run up to the other construction area and see what we need to get for our big coop. I think I just need a shit ton of wood and I think 10,000, 10,000 gold if I'm not mistaken. Alright, so I got here and I missed the deadline. Oops. <laughs> ah, well. I don't think I showed this yet. Not sure if I did. Oh, there's worms over there. Do I have my hoe on me? Nope. I'm upgrading my hoe right now. There's more worms over there, too. If you go in this bathhouse, you can get uh, stamina for yourself. It heals you, it revives your energy. It's really good. Really good for you in general. Well, 
saw that. Guess I'll just come back to my farm. And we'll end the day. I should gain a level from this, and then if I gain the level, then I can use sprinklers. Which would be so nice, because then I can just water all of these. Using the sprinklers. All I gotta do is get a gold, gold ingot. That's not hard at all. Alright, well we're going to end this right here. Well, not end it, but we're going to... Yep, level 6 farming, sweet. With this quality sprinkler, it allows me to do all the adjacent aisle, all the adjacent tiles according to it, and it helps out a lot. Uh, cheese press. Uh, ooh, level 5 forging. Forester. 50% more wood. Chance for double harvest of forged items. Uh, I think I'll want this one. With that, I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys for watching, and if you guys uh, like the video, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I hope the blueberries gave you some a little bit insight on how to make me a little bit of money. Um, it does help you out quite a bit. Um, thank you guys for watching. Thanks.